Welcome back, everybody. Dren608 plays. Playing Pathfinder and Wrath of the Righteous. Oh, my goodness. What a battle that was. Uh, the cultist conjurer here did something. Grabbed his stuff. Um, examine the altars. Look at the statues. Investigate the water source. I have a bunch of stuff to still do in here. Uh... There's a lever, Clunk. Okay. His armor off. His armor still on. Okay. It doesn't let me. Why can't I look at the statue? The other statues I need to look at? I sense something. Ah. Uh. Spelled a bunch of magic on Bismuth. There's these magic things all over the place, but I'm not... I don't know. We examined the statues before. Prison? What the hell? I'm not able to look at these statues. <clears throat> Maybe out here? Cactus is somebody laboriously pounded on them with something heavy. <coughs> Altar is covered with profane and insulting inscriptions that have been scratched into a stone surface. Okay, so I've examined the altars. Investigate the water source. The water source. Breaks of rot. Gained 4,600 experience points. How do I? See, we're up to. We need under 600,000 now. Alright, so. Hope of improvement. Why is there no hope for improvement? That's rude. Okay, so I think we've done everything that we need to do here. Right? So 
So how do I get out of here without tripping any more traps? Coming over this way? I don't know. Trips, traps. They trap, trips, trips. There was something over here. What is this? Use this hole to enter the shrine. So this is how they got in. I can't get in here. Can't get in to this space. Okay, so the shrine of three is pretty much done here. So we can go back outside. We got to go back to the to the dudes. Here we go. should have healed. So, so. I can't get to there. There's no place closer, is there? That's just as far. Alright, well. Let's head back to here. Don't really want to fight. want to fight at this point. Okay. Now last time I rested here, it didn't work. So we're going to abyssal corruption ourselves out of... Go back to cheese persona. Scoot over. I want my scaly side facing the fire. My lizard side always gets colder than my warm-blooded side. <laughs> Go figure. <laughs> it was weakened, but it just, it's supposed to protect me for the shrine. There's a resting place there. All right, we're going to go back to these guys, and then we're going to go... Hoping that we can get there without having to rest again. I don't know. Um, by the way, if you like what you see, it's home slap the button really right to see you. Go ahead and subscribe, hit the notify bell. Shall we fight? Let's have a fight. I haven't had a fight. This is the last hour long fight. Uh. Alright, uh, what's going on here? Oh, I need to get on my horse. That's what's going on here. Get on my hoss. Uh, the struggles never cease. Put that on me. I don't think we're going to go with a death ward here. These usually don't require death wards. She'll go ahead and cast Feather Step on all of us. Cast a Park Skin on herself. Up a bow. Put up this. Has suffered enough. Just put up armor here. Armor on himself. Light poison. Rely on me. She'll put up this. This. Uh. Ember. That. Armor on yourself. Land has a bark skin, right? I don't see Land having up his bark skin. Greatest challenge. Uh, do your sword. Should I? I will go ahead and sword up. And everybody together. Let's go find out what we're fighting. Oh, I hate these things because that means I can never charge. I can handle it. Oh, ash giants! I don't care about ash giants. Can I charge these ash Here giants? We go again. I can charge an Do ash not giant. Speak. Do not waver. Haru, I will resist. 
Ember. I don't think you can get off of spell. You only have one. You only have one spell. One action. So move up. It's also the same thing. Just move up. Land. Just move up. So yeah, uh, just move up. Smith, just move up. Aru. Prepare your Nino. Or not Nino, uh Ember. Uh <coughs> Yep, that's on. So it's not really lightning, it's So, just move up. I'm gonna charge this one. <coughs> Take their stuff. Something else here, most likely. We're just gonna get out of here. Keep on our way. Dun 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 dun. There's a demon army moving here, so I need to do some demon, some army stuff. Where's my army? Uh, where is it? It's down there. So we're going to have you move down here. We got to do something about our things anyway, so let's come down here. Our morale it's still at 20. Let them flee. I needed to go take out a castle here, too. That's a level 9 army. I don't know if I'm good enough to take out that army. Do need to do something about capturing a thing. Maybe I want to. Oh, that's an 11. I need to do something about my armies. Alright, let's finish me off here. Alright, let's go talk to this guy. Um. Go up here. And we gotta go tell them the bad news. The water can't be fixed. Okay. Tries to make his contagious eyes sound at least remotely welcome. Why, hello there, guest. Your time in hiding from death is at an end. Swarm could absorb him. Uh, I have bad news. The shrine of three has been defiled by demons. Everyone considers your words and gives a decisive nice. So things are really bad then. Oh well, we'll teach ourselves new ways to survive. It's not like we had it easy before. We will get used to it. No fish? We were sick of fish anyway. The water stinks? Well, it's there for drinking, not sniffing. And if our guts twist, so be it. Nobody's died of cramps yet. No! Thank you, Outsider, for trying to help. We'll make it somehow. Don't you worry. There will be a reward for you, and then you'll leave. After you do, we'll close our little door and cover it with rocks just to make sure. We don't want the demons from the world womb to come knocking, do we? Sorry, friends, but it's only going to get worse. You'll have to abandon the mine and look for a new home. You won't last long here. Well, I'm a plus 45. Stop hiding the duck. You want to feel the warmth of the sun, see a sunset, or enjoy an apple, if nothing else? I need an 8 to do that one. I'm going to do this one. Higher numbers usually mean more prescription, more uh, experience points. 
He succeeded. You may be, uh -huh, you may be right. Maybe we should stop burying ourselves in this rocky tomb. We may be safer this way, but to the rest of the world, we might as well be dead. Whether we live or die, what difference does it make to everyone else? Maybe it's time for us to go. Not for ourselves, but for our children's sake. Alright, some more 1700 experience points. Thank you, home. Thank you for me for berating you when I could bear the dampness and dark no more. We're all alive because thanks to you, after all, and we'll remember that. So the kid says, you lead these crusaders of yours. Can you do us one last favor? Send your people here and let them mine. There are many veins of good ore down here. You won't regret it even a little bit, and my home won't be lonely. My heart aches as if as if we are leaving while our ancestors are staying behind. I guess it's time we said our goodbyes, too. Sounds genuinely touched. I will go with these people so they have at least some chance of survival. Farewell, Captain. I hope we'll meet again. Here's your strong, honest handshake. We'll make our way north to the realm of the Mammoth Lords. Cannot describe how grateful I am. Thank you again for helping me find these poor people. I've been on this path my whole life, but I never would have made the final step without you. Yeah, okay. Guns ones on mine. Reload and they won't be here. Now we're outside. Game auto save. Okay, so they kicked us out. I can't get out this way. I have to get out this way. Can I go back in there? Are they still in there? Oh, why? It's stuffed me all the way back out there. That's weird. You can go into the mine shaft. Just curious if they're still here. They're still here. I can still talk to them. I can still talk to them. Oh, okay. So supposedly they're going to leave, but it doesn't look like they really are. Wonder if I have a decree to mine this mine shaft fourteen or something. <laughs> All right, uh, let's get out of here. We need to go back to our citadel. We've got stuff to do. Then I gotta go do some more companion quests here. So let's get out of here. I gotta get my army built up and going off to, after a, a thing. There's the Bladesmith's workshop. I think I have to go this way to get to the Bladesmith's workshop. So I have to go like clear this army, clear this army, clear this thing, and then I can get to the blade. There's the Valley of Temples. So we definitely have to clear, clear probably this fort, which is the Demon Stone 11. Nasty. <clears throat> so many things I need to do. All right, um, I'm going to have us teleport all the way back to Dresden. We're going to have some cutscenes here, so that's probably going to be the rest of this thing here. I didn't want to do that. I want to go into the place, you stupid machine. Okay, we want to enter here. Um, guess we're going to go to the Citadel and do our cutscenes first. So I know we've got a couple of things that are going to happen here, so let's just go do this. Uh, if you like what you see, hit the thumbs up button. If you really like to see, go ahead and subscribe. Hit the notify bell. Be notified upload videos and schedule streams. Oh boy, this is because we did start a couple decrees. I think that are going to be finishing now since I've rested several days out in the wilderness.
There we go. What's this? Gasmera. Gasmera looks the same as before, but far more weary. So it is true. The commander has returned from the dead. We've heard all manners of rumors, but we did not know where to believe. So I came here myself to be sure it's true and not yet another trick of the demons. So this is Winter Sun. What's the news from Winter Sun? But time would heal Winter Sun, but it hasn't been easy. People gradually returned to their lives, but the mere sight of their homeland brought back memories. New horse driver is destroying the malicious magic to use to confuse the minds and souls of the people of Winter Sun. Of the atrocities. This is why when the demons returned, we didn't fight the way we should have. Oh dear. What will you do now? We will leave in search of a better life. The place we called home all these centuries no longer accepts us. There are too many ghosts here, too many memories. I don't know where we'll go, but I'll pray to the spirits that the new place will accept us. So winter sun's disappearing. Okay, I don't have anything I can offer her. That's sad. May the spirits watch over you. I hope our paths will cross again someday. I'll tell you to go north. Alright, here we go. Captain Harmatin. Commander, glad to see you back with us. Commander Harmatin has barely changed since your last meeting. But his glare is now even heavier than before, and his arms and face bear new scars. You have arrived just in time. There is unrest within your forces once again. Unfortunately, once you returned, so did the wary. They were returning soldiers against you. I'm afraid we're dealing with an open mutiny. Oh, crap. Give me a break. They're agitating for the army to abandon Dresden and march to Iz to Her Majesty's aid. If we don't stop them, the outcome may be disastrous. I know that. Let's meet with the wary. I don't believe it will be hard to convince them that their plan is pure madness. Gather loyal officers and send them to speak with the soldiers, unarmed and with an open heart. We'll convince them to turn their backs on those madmen and their mutinies. That's Sela. Mutinies must be suppressed with absolute severity. We surround all units engaged in the revolt. Then we arrest and hang the agitators publicly. Behind every rebellious leader is a very angry second in command who dreams of promotion. We'll just hint at the fastest way to get it, and the mutiny will fade away by itself, and the added benefit of refreshing our staff. Where is our lawyer to the queen? Why didn't they leave with her instead of remaining in Dresden? I couldn't say, Commander. I believe we should talk to them and find out their reasoning and their plan of action. I do agree that this all looks very suspicious. We will pass the perception check. You also have a great deal of respect for Queen Galfrey, don't you? I'm a soldier. It's my duty to respect my superiors. I hold you in high esteem as well. You catch nervous trembling in a Hartman's voice, partially masked by his calm and relaxed tone. Okay, if we do this... Oh, jeez, oh, Pete. Start of the battle, the units gain 15 bonus command. Okay. Regil, the decimation. Any unit in the army that gains a plus three bonus to combat morale when damaged. Okay. Darian? Bloodthirsty officers! Start of the battle, all enemy units suffer minus 15 penalty to combat. This is. We reduce the morale by 25. Okay. Test of strength feat. All units gain plus one combat morale each turn. Hmm. Well, that's interesting. Do I want to parley with them or do I want to just say to hell with all of you? Uh, let's discuss something. Self-directed march or a bluff. Only lunatics would follow such a suicidal plan. So Arian asks them what they really want. Don't parley with mutineers. We all know what they want. The same thing as everybody else. Power and money. We'll just be playing to the hands of the warrior if we sit down and talk with them as equals. Arian, behind the back of the queen's ringleaders of the wary, we don't even have to hire assassins. The promise of a promotion and a pay raise is all it will take for a second in command to do their duty. Be it by a dagger or a drop of poison, they'll make good officers feared by allies and enemies alike. I know that what 
that the word honor means nothing to you, but this idea is horrible, even from the most cynical perspective. What's the point of running ourselves as schemers and traitors if we're only going to replace them with other schemers and traitors and murderers to boot? Both should be nipped in the bud. We'll surround the mutinous attachments, then publicly execute the wary and all those convicted of instigation. If seditious tendencies persist, we do it again. It's the only way to ensure the troops' loyalty. Even if there were any doubts before, it's perfectly clear now the soldiers are not to blame for anything. They are being provoked by dishonorable officers. It would be a crime to turn our loyal troops against them. When we, those who give them orders, must convince them not with blades, but with words. We will appeal to their conscience and make them abandon the madness no matter how the insiders of the commander saying. First thing is unarmed would be a definition of madness. I'm not even going to discuss this plan of sorts. Everything is clear. I'm going to do it my way, kids. I like this trust of strength of the... This, I like this. So we're going to do it my way. I dare not process, but for the record, I believe you're making a mistake that might lead to terrible consequences. Maybe. I'll keep you up to date on how things unfold. As soon as there are any developments, I will reckon, reconvene the council. Who's this? Captain Odan. Commander, glad to see you back at the head of the military council. A decision is required of you more urgently than ever. Here's the situation. We don't have an army in the strictest sense, and the enemy is putting up much more of a fight than previously. Judging by the reports, the demons are relying less and less on the armies of their mortal servants and the power of simple blades, and more and more on magic and dark sorceries. We must respond in kind by bolstering forces with expert spellcasters. I'm prepared to send an order to Canabras at once. Requesting the necessary reinforcements, our pros our army with bardic magic. Bards learn all kinds of spells in their travels, and their songs can inspire warriors and give them strength to fight. He wants bards. These demons know their vile magics, but I know something stronger than that. The power of the gods. We need some war priests in our army. Their spells will chase away the darkness and heal the wounded. War priests. We would do well to invite monks into our army. They've been hardened by a lifetime of training, and even demonic corruption cannot harm them. He wants monks. You're in need of mages versed in the art of killing. You should contact the Dagamark Poisoners Guild. Their alchemists are second to none when it comes to making deadly poisons or utilizing them in battle. <coughs> Why didn't you leave with Galfrey? I did put in a request for a transfer to the front lines. Unfortunately, it was refused. Command determined that due to the psychological trauma I suffered during my years of service on the border, I'm no longer fit for battlefield command. Oh. As much as it stings to admit it, they may be right. It's been a long time since I smelled burning flesh and heard the screams of battle, and I can't guarantee that when I do, I'll be able to maintain my composure. That I won't fail the soldiers who have been depending on me. However, I can still serve them by staying where I am. Okay. Uh, we've been able to manage the magic we have so far. The more serious the threat we become for them, the more substantial will be the forces they throw at us. Goron of the days when the Abyss would casually send hosts of mindless cultists and lower demons. Now we're against more cunning and skilled opponents who can incinerate a dozen soldiers with a single spell. We must respond with this magic of our own, or we will lose. Are you sure they will send us troops? Without a doubt. Canaveras is much safer than we are at the moment, and I'm convinced that Goron can reward some forces for us. So all of Mendev knows that right now. Dresden is the dam holding back the river of demonic corruption that would otherwise be flooding to the south. Kingdom is in the process of mobilization. Queen Galvers and March on Niche has encouraged many who previously shirked military service to join the ranks of the army. Alright, War Priests. <sighs> war Priests. They can cure moderate wounds. Aura of Courage. All units in radius of two squares gain plus four to saving throws against fear. The spell. Get rid of their positive, get rid of our negative. Okay. They aren't worth a dang in a fight. Alright, that's War Priest. Monks. What do monks give us? Monks. Can do a shield wall, armor cast 26, do a little bit of damage. They. Have damage reduction three. Okay. This one. We get assassins. 
sneak move. U unit can teleport to any unoccupied square instead of moving. Units attack, target, and apply at minus two penalty to strength. Do lots of damage. Huh. I have no idea who to pick here. Assassins seem to do quite a bit of damage. What do bards do? Bards. Aura of superiority. It's a swift action on all allied units in the radius. Two squares gain plus two on all ability scores for one round. Caution. Plus four bonus saving throws. Plus three bonus to armor class. Ace of two squares gain three three bonus to attack for one round. Ah, oh, God. So I have to pick one. I think I like Captain Odan's idea. They seem to have the most uh, flexible. I mean, they don't hit worth a damn. Well, they can protect, protect, protect. Plus one. Plus one. Sweet bonus. Plus four saving throws. Plus three to armor class. What do Warfreeze do? Again. 79 hit points. <coughs> the fact that they can cure. I mean, saving first three years is okay. They can dispel bad things and cure wounds. Dang it, I don't know. Go with the war priest, I guess. Yeah, fine. Not what I wanted to have happen. All right, we're at 32 minutes. I'm going to go ahead and put a uh, cut in here. And if you like what you see, hit the thumbs up button. If you really like to see, go ahead and subscribe. Hit the notify bell. Beginning of next round, we're probably going to have to uh, do a... Still have to go find. That's what I stopped to do here. I have to find the queen. I have to go to this too. So now we gotta go find Mustafa's secret hideout and save Targona. And we have to save the hind of the inheritor. And we have to learn kill by time. Visit Mustafa in the street and hideout. I gotta go do this. I have this to do. Gotta save the lands people. Kill the outsider for Darien. Don't talk to the Hell Knights. Go talk to the Bladesmith. Finish Nino's quest once I find the fourth mask. Oi! The end game is annoying. All right. And as far as we are concerned, we are still 555,000 points away from the level. So we're not going to get level. I don't think we'll make 20th level in this game either. I just don't see how you can make 3 million experience points. Even doing all the quests that are out there, it just doesn't strike me as you can get there. All right. Like I said, if you like what you see, a thumbs up button. If you really like, so you go and subscribe, hit the notify bell, be notified, upload videos, and schedule streams. I'm Dren608. Until we meet again, stay safe and bye bye.